As the community mourns the loss of Officer Carr, we're learning more details about his suspected shooter, London Phillips. He was looking for an officer to kill. Take a look at your screen. It's this man, London Phillips, who Fayetteville Police Chief Mike Reynolds says murdered his officer, Stephen Carr, Saturday night. Evidence shows that Officer Carr was ambushed and executed while he was sitting in his patrol vehicle. During a press conference held Sunday, Chief Reynolds described the moments after Carr was found shot dead. These Fayetteville police officers, Corporal Shea Floyd and Officer Natalie Yusey, shot and killed Phillips. If it wasn't for the response of our officers that engaged and killed the suspect, yes, I do believe that he would have hurt more people, possibly more officers or possibly citizens within our community. Phillips found with multiple rounds. The suspect had a 9mm Taurus and he had two boxes of ammunition. Now just days after Officer Carr's death, we're learning more about the man accused of pulling the trigger. A Jackson, Missouri native who has previously had a run-in with Fayetteville police. In December of last year, the suspect was uh, we had a call on the suspect impersonating a police officer. But his criminal record dates back even further to October 2012. Court records out of the Palm Beach County Sheriff's Office in Florida reveal Phillips was charged with domestic assault on October 2nd. In a victim statement, Deborah Cox wrote this letter. It reads in part, London, my son, has been on a psychotic roller coaster toward me all evening. She continued, he threatened me while hugging me, whispered in my ear, I'll burn you. Days later, Later, he was arrested for violating a no-contact order, but ultimately the case against him was dismissed because of insufficient evidence. Now, fast forward seven years, it's Phillips who Chief Reynolds says murdered one of his own. All I know is that this was a cowardly act, and I have no information that leads me to believe that he targeted this officer specifically. In Fayetteville, Chelsea Helms, KWA Northwest Arkansas News.